everyone welcome back to the Thailand YouTube channel page today we have to see Sicilian defense Alapin variation in the last video we saw Sicilian defense closed the variation but I think they're going to make Alapin variation so first we have to make Sicilian defense so to make Sicilian defense you know king spawn from the white is very much necessary now and the black moving c4 makes Sicilian defense and now this time if we make a knight to move here that is called closed variation but I think in this time we are going to make a c pawn open here c3 you know c3 when it is open this is called a lapin variation and also c3 has a power on the city squares however it is getting uh, screwed by this uh, pawn so this is how the c3 pawn is open but in this case this pawn looks a little alone i think this pawn looks not supported by any pawn because knight was there to support but i think now knight cannot be open taking this as an advantage black is just opening this knight so that uh, i can have a uh, thinking of capturing uh, that uh, pawn in this case what happens we have to save this uh, pawn how you are going to save this pawn by just moving to f3 pawn will not be a good move because uh, even though this supports here but this is uh, making open space for king uh, it's a little risky for the white hands uh, I think in this case uh, f3 is not a good move and here d3 is also not a good move because uh, it's blocking the again bishop actually it's blocking the bishop again hence the reason d3 is also not good in this move it's very easy move is just to push this uh, e4 pawn to e5 once e5 is done and this is threatening this knight and also making knight to move away from the place and that is a kind of a waste move for the black to some extent we can consider like this in this case where can i can move well i cannot move here or here also because queen is there to capture so i think knight has only do two good things now one is here and uh, i mean that is uh, nd5 and one more is uh, ne4 which one to move suppose what happens if you move to ne4 and if if you open it, if you move it because that time d3 is moved then your knight is just gone because there is no good move or a safe move for the knight because here and all it cannot travel because of this pawn and again this is taken by the bishop and of course next year and all you know it's and all is is impossible to move and so reason this is not a good move for uh, knight to move any four this is always good to move an ng5 I and mean, this one so nd5 sorry nd5 is a very good move uh, for the black to move here and in this case uh, again uh, the bishop this bishop needs to open or this bishop needs to open we can consider the minor pieces to be open in this case uh, bishop just goes and lands on c4 that is called bc4 you know why the reason it can just also threaten on this one as well it has a, a very far view on this square and supported by this square this queen coming here and checkmate threat is there as well it is threatening uh, knight so this is how uh, that's why the best move for uh, bishop is to come on bc4 in this case how we are going to safeguard this knight however this knight can be saved with this uh, pawn however but again this bishop is getting blocked this bishop is getting blocked hence the best move for uh, black in this queen. i mean the most of the people what does is just nb6 uh, moving nb6 uh, is not only giving threat uh, also making a waste move for a white hence in this case uh, the very common the very best move i mean the very needed move for the white is just to go back so bishop just stepped one step back that is the bb3 bishop just started on the bb3 now again you know what the common moves done by the black now you can see the bishop's position is not that much safe and now making this black piece on a d position d5 pawn d5 when this makes d5 you know the intention of making a d5 when they push the c4 and the bishop is still stepping back that's the thing hence the reason and this is moved is just stepping back because there is no other way the bishop can move and so reason c4 is smooth so this is how the alapin uh, variation is uh, played now uh, this is very basic knowledge of alapin variation we still need to study very very deep uh, the common common different different uh, um, uh, chances of moves or variations in alapin variation 